In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. The Lord be with you. Brothers and sisters, we have come rejoicing into the house of the Lord for this celebration, dear brothers and sisters. And now we stand with Daniel and Nicole on the day they intend to form a home of their own. But that love had come from the conviction that I am loved by God. And the person that I give my life to is so precious in God's eye. And many of us can also share with you the challenges in life, in marriage. But Pope Francis reminds us that in difficult times, God's grace is there. It's an opportunity to encounter God, to depend on His love and His power. For us to experience to be loved and to love in return, it depends on that love and that love on the cross. For when Daniel said yes to Nicole and Nicole said yes to Daniel, and when you love each other more and more each day the way that God calls you to love, you reflect the love of Jesus for the church, for all of us. And that love is to die to himself for the other person. And so that's why St. Paul defined what love is. And you can always apply to yourself. Love is patient, love is kind. At that moment, you can mention, say, Daniel is patient, Nicole is kind. Daniel is not jealous, Nicole is not pompous. Daniel is not inflated, Nicole is not rude. Daniel does not seek his own interests. Nicole is not quick tempered. Nicole does not brood over injury. Daniel does not rejoice over wrongdoing, but rejoices with the truth. Nicole bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and do all things. For as you know, love never fails. I, Daniel, take you, Nicole, to be my wife. I, Daniel, take you, Nicole, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Nicole, take you, Daniel, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Brothers and sisters, may I introduce to you for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Daniel Hansen. So in all seriousness, Daniel, it's been an honor and a privilege to serve as your best man today. You are a very fortunate man to have met such a wonderful woman as Nicole. She's caring, loving, smart, and the perfect match for you any day of the week. Uh, the two of you have a healthy and loving marriage, and I'm thrilled to call you both my friends.
I will end with um, a quote from Elizabeth Bennett's father in Pride and Prejudice. I could not bear to part with you to anyone less worthy, but it seems that I'm overruled. So I heartily give my consent, and um, I love you both. Um, so congratulations.